What's going on guys, it's Curve Cinemas and I have every single message in the bottle for you guys today. So as you can see, I'm overlooking Oasis over here. We're going to get right into this. And you see a bottle right here. If you take a look at my map, it's right over here, right by the fast travel where you come out at the end of the uh, the DLC playthrough. So you can see it right there. Um, you guys want to head from there. We're going to run right over once you pick it up. Um, here you're going to be getting a shotgun, I believe. So once you take this, we're going to fast forward. Run over to the sand skiff. It's not that far of a run, but what are you going to do? Um, so we're going to drive right over here. Boom! We are there. You guys are going to look for this big old X right here. And it's right here located on the map inside this little garage. You guys are going to walk on over to it, press this button, open up the garage, and get your loot. Blade Hog. I had to stage another fake execution today. One of the cooks was caught stealing from the treasure hole, so I had to pretend to kill him to keep the rest of the crew in line. Gave him enough cash to disappear, shot him overboard with a blank. <sighs> Keeping up this face, some Captain Blade retains a hell of a lot of work. Alright guys, the next one is in Wormwater. This is the fast travel station. You guys want to run north and go left right over here by the entrance from Oasis. You guys are going to see this nice little um, ledge rock kind of thing. You're going to jump on it and you're going to see the bottle right there hanging off the tree. There's a nice chest next to it. So as long as your guys parkour skills is um, amazing like mine, you guys can obviously climb this tree. Um, you're going to want to grab it. This one you're getting an awesome shield and I'll show you guys where that is. So it's kind of difficult. You can see the giant skeleton fish in the background. You guys have to go around. So we're going to drive right around here and you're going to come to the Hedgeland camp or something like that. And um, you guys are going to run a run forward, go through all this fighting, whatever. There's going to be a bunch, a bunch, a bunch of enemies over here. And um, there's going to be a nice X just laying there for you guys to check it out. After two years, 300 looted sand barges and zero casualties. I think the man is starting to unravel. They want to kill stuff. They want to split the loot and have their separate ways. They don't seem to get the fact that our whole operation isn't about greed or bloodlust. It's about survival. We stop robbing ships, we starve. We split up, we die. I won't let that happen. All right, guys, the next one's located in Hater's Folly. You're going to go right over to this little elevator thing. You guys are going to know where it is. You're going to see the exclamation point on the map. You guys are going to want to jump as it's going up, and you're going to see this message in the bottle right there. You guys are going to get an awesome assault rifle. So you're going to activate the quest and run over to the waterfall-type area in the um, waypoint. And you guys are going to jump down. You're going to see a, a lot of ledges. I didn't know what I was looking for here because I didn't know where I was going. And I was looking around this entire area. You saw I was looking in the water. I was going to jump down, and then I looked over there, and I saw a bottle. And I was like, another quest? So I hit it, and it opened up this awesome cave. And I was like, what? So yeah, and then you get surprised by a nice cave crystalisk, crystalisk, whatever would you like to call it. And yeah, so there's going to be a nice little um, X in the back of this room. You guys can go ahead and pick that up and claim your next prize. The crew were going to mutiny. The cook I pretended to kill. They found him sitting around in an oasis while I guarded the boat. After they strung him up, they got to talking. Found out I'd never killed another soul in my life. My guess is they'll raid the treasure room for guns and shoot me when my back's turned. Alright guys, the next one's in the rusty yards. Run, 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 run. Right past my man, Herbert. And you guys are going to see this entrance to this back area. You guys are going to run up that ladder. You can see that the fast travel's down here. You guys are going to run north. You guys are going to want to go to that direction right there. You can see it's a message in the bottle. I'm going to fast forward it really quick. We're going to run up here and around the back to the little exclamation point. It's pretty straightforward. Um, I was searching this room. There's a nice squeaky doll in this room too behind me. But in order to get this, you guys want to hop up behind here and just grab the bottle. You have found one of Captain Blade's bottles. Inside the bottle, you will find a key. The key opens a chest. The chest has loot. The loot will help you kill things. Find the chest, my friend. 
All right, guys, you can see the next area here, right at the top. You just follow the path. You just guys, just continue once you cross that bridge. You guys can come check it out under here, under this little porch. And yeah, nice relic. myself I'd let him kill me but I, I couldn't let it I, I fought back I dare get sticky with their blood today they finally met the fearsome Captain Blade all right guys the next one is in Magnus Lighthouse you guys are gonna see this little exclamation point on over here so I want you guys head over to it you're gonna see this broken abandoned destroyed sand skiff kind of thing so you guys want to go over here and just grab this bottle and i'm going to show you guys how to get there you have to take the elevator all the way to the top you guys i'm sure you know where that is um so once you get to the top you're going to be at the top of the lighthouse you can look over an edge and you'll see this giant rock with an x on it on the western side i believe it is and then you just dig and grab your loot treasure. It got my entire crew killed. But if you want to die looking for it, have fun. This is Captain Blade signing off for good. Alright guys, I'm going to show you these items that we got from these awesome, awesome, awesome side quests. So first we have the uh, assault rifle, the swift rapier. Uh, mine has some awesome uh, bayoneted slag going on. Then we have the la orphan maker, and it's pretty sick. It's got crazy amounts of damage. Um, this is the thing that I got from what's his face, uh, the big sleep. Yeah, it's pretty awesome. Um, we also have this awesome relic. That heals you as you commit murder, which is always cool. And right down here we have this awesome grenade mod that does some crazy shit. I haven't looked at it, but I'm sure it does some crazy shit. <laughs> Alright guys, I hope you found them easily. Ooh, and this shield. This shield's wild. Every time you punch something, something explodes. Throw that on your assassin. ba ba bam You know what I'm saying? Alright guys, well thanks for watching, and I'll talk to you guys soon. Peace.